Breaking news here on Martin Lucas. Investor, why is Tilray Brands going down? In fact, this whole sector is going down. Is it bad? Is it an opportunity? Yep. It's one of those. I'll tell you all about it. It's in fact, should I save it to the end? I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll tell you if it's bad or good if you tap the like button. Have you done it? Because like, it's, it's as if I know, because when I record this video, it has two outcomes. And the outcomes can change depending on whether you've uh, tapped the like button or not. Do you believe that? Some people do. Some people will believe that. They'll go, I believe that. So I'm going to like it just in case. Right. Okay. Here comes the news. We've got two political parties with the election this year, coming up in November, both wanting to get this reclassified to get Tilray and to get the reclassification done so they can both win votes. The trouble is they're both, they both want to do it. Both sides of the camp want to get this through. So does that mean, does that mean it's not important anymore because one side's not doing it and the other? No, I don't agree. I think, I still think it's going to happen. However, We've got a, uh, a spanner in the works. We've got a spoke. We've got a stick in the spoke on the cycle and, the, and everyone's falling off going, oh my God, sell Tilray Brands today. I see it as an opportunity because we've, uh, we're about to get the biggest earnings of our lifetime. Tomorrow night, NVIDIA. All the markets are selling off. Everything's overreacting. Everything's selling off in preparation for the biggest earnings of our lifetime. Tomorrow night, NVIDIA earnings. We're going to cover it. It's going to be 10,000 people watch it, I would imagine. It's going to be a huge event for us. Huge event for everybody investing, the whole market. So the whole market is going down today because everything is selling off because NVIDIA is going to be good. And you might go, well, why are they doing that? Well, if you, if, if, if you know it's going to be good, Wall Street dump it to buy it back. So you've got all the high speculative stocks like Tilray getting dragged into it. But there is some news. And here is the news. This is what's adding to the fuel, but you put the two together and you get a perfect scenario to drive the stock down to buy more back. For me, it's a buying opportunity. So I say once again, for those that are like confused, thinking, hang on a minute, is this good or bad? I say it's a green day. I say it's a green day and I'm going to look into my crystal ball and give you the information right now. I look into my crystal ball and I've always said the same thing. If till rate is under $2, it's a buy. And now it's way under $2. Without further ado, did you all tap the like button? Yeah, you did. Okay, here's the news because payday is coming to Tilray. Here we go. This is the news only just out a few moments ago and I'm going to share it with you right now. Let me just come back to this screen. It was sent in by one of our members who invests in this stock. So we thank uh, very much Mike for sending it in. The DEA has rescheduled a hearing in early December to discuss the Justice's Department proposal for rescheduling. Uh, to move that could delay formal action on the matter until the next presidential administration. Important words there. It's all in the context. It's all in the words, right? Remember, it's going to be, and it already is, in the manifesto, if you like. Both parties, both sides of the house want this to be a vote winner for you. They want to get this through. It might have a bit of a delay now due to this. But with NVIDIA earnings, market selling off, negative news, the market, uh, uh, Tilray, the whole sector has been sold off. I see it as an opportunity. And it's not going to go much lower because if we look at the overall market, and it's important to do that, keeps trying to sell off, keeps bouncing back because everyone knows that NVIDIA is going to do well, which means NVIDIA will do well, Google will do well, Microsoft will do well, Apple will do well, Amazon will do well, and everybody else will just jump in because the whole market is doing well. This is a, um, a blip, uh, a spoke, a stick in the spoke, I don't know. You know what I mean. But at the end of the day, this is an opportunity, I believe, because you can see the markets are going back up again. They just, they just don't want to sell off, and they're not going to sell off. And, and NVIDIA is going to be earning. So this is an opportunity, right? The agency said that after the notice of proposed uh, rulemaking was issued, it received numerous requests for a hearing, which is scheduled for December the 2nd. The Federal Register no 
notice was posted late Monday, but won't be formally published until August. Let me just make that a bit smaller. I'm trying to fill it in the screen. August 29th. It was signed by the DEA administrant, administrator, Anne Milgram. Anyone interested in participating in the hearing must file a written request, explain their interests and specifics on their obligations and so on and so forth, blah, 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 blah. Nothing else there of real uh, interest to share with you other than the fact that we have got, I believe, an opportunity right now because it's a perfect storm. We've got everything selling off, but not really. It's going down and bouncing straight back up again. We've got NVIDIA earnings tomorrow night. We're going to cover it live. I think between now and tomorrow evening, you're going to get volatility here. Anything under $2 is worth, is, worth, uh, is worth buying. We've already looked at it before. I'll give you a quick update. <clears throat> uh, let me just duplicate this screen. I might as well. I might as well give you some extra information. Sh should I be nice to you? All right, I will. I'll do you, I'm doing a mini review here, Mike. All right, mini review here, Mike. Uh, let me share with you um, some latest information just in. Uh, okay, we can bring that to you. Let me open up that one. I'll bring that one. Uh, let me bring you the ratings on factor grade seeking alpha for, for Tilray. Here we go. So what we've got here, at Quant, which is the um, the AI software at uh, Seeking Alpha, it's a buy. Wall Street hold, and analysts are saying sell. That doesn't surprise me at all. And as I say this, look exactly what I said. Look, the market is coming straight back up again, and so will Tilray. So be very careful. You've got an opportunity here to buy a dip, and this is important. And I'm going to throw all analysts now under the bus because anyone can be an analyst on Seeking Alpha. I am an analyst on Seeking Alpha. You do not have to be a financial advisor or anything anything of the such. You just have to have an opinion and a voice online to be a, an analyst. And uh, I would expect that anyone who analyzes this stock uh, for money, because they get paid to report these uh, analysis, these uh, uh, reports for Seeking Alpha, it's an opportunity to say it's a sell, very different than Wall Street, very different than the AI, the AI model, but so the analysts are going to sell to drive it down to buy it back. I'm just being very sceptical there, but I actually do think that this is an opportunity. This is a bullish video, even though it looks like it's going down. Looking at that, looking at the valuation, uh, growth, A+, plus, profitability, B+, plus, momentum, C+, plus, revisions, B. Uh, all this is good. The only thing is the valuation, but... This was uh, before the value dropped this morning. All right, so this is good. This is probably now a B or a C. Anyway, that's beside the point. Um, let me share with you another way of putting the news to you. This just came in, another way of, it, uh, of, of, of explaining it. Can, uh, I'm trying to avoid saying these words. It's beneficial to my channel. Uh, on watch as... <laughs> But the word begin with C, uh, stocks on watch as DEA sets hearing uh, rescheduling. So let's just read how they've explained it. Related stocks, you like that? Will come under invest, investor scrutiny on Tuesday after the Drug Enforcement Administration, DEA, scheduled a public hearing to consider different views on the US uh, Justice Department recent proposal to, to, to reclassify <coughs> rescheduling. The hearing schedule for December the 2nd prolongs the, the process uh, under which uh, the currently categorized alongside... De uh, I'm trying to avoid these words. Lots of words here. In fact, I need to get that off the screen. I don't want, that. I don't want those words on the screen. This is a temporary blip, basically, and I think that this is an opportunity. Thank you to uh, Mike for sending this in. I really do appreciate it. Uh, there you go. A little update there. Um, now, of course, even though it might not happen before the election, it will be in the actionable from once the administration is uh, uh, goes into full force, and that's in January, right? Is it January? So you haven't got that long to wait. I see this as an opportunity, and I don't think it will stay down here after the earnings tomorrow night. See if I'm right. Come back and say, you talk rubbish, or bloody hell, Martin, you were spot on there. Normally people say I'm spot on, if I'm honest. I'm going to be honest and tell you how it is. 
but sometimes I get it wrong. Just not very often. <laughs> all right, click above my head for all the links down below in the description. Thanks, Mike, for sending it in. Over here, I shall put the, uh, the Tilray playlist, and down here, you're welcome. Mike 166A donated $2 through a super chat. Thanks very much. You're welcome. And right down here, I shall put the NVIDIA earnings. It's related. It really is related. It's the overall market. Down here is the NVIDIA earnings. Join me. I think I'm going to be right. You can join me live and say I was right, which I'll go, thanks a lot. I told you. Or you can be in the chat saying, I knew you were wrong. You talk rubbish. You're a bloody idiot. You can do that if you want. And I just block you. So either way, I win. Doesn't matter. I'm joking. I reply to everyone's comments, even those that call me a bloody idiot. Don't worry about it. Join me live. Until next time, as always, take care of yourselves and each other.